Hey guys! In this video, we are going to test the best mountaineering boots for women you can buy right now. I made this checklist based on my personal opinions and study time. And I've listed them based on the security and pricing features I've included for options for each type of consumer. So you can easily verify this best mountaineering boots for women for yourself or your family. We always try to provide customers with informative ideas so that they can easily verify any product. If you would like more information and would like to set an updated price on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description below. Our first choice the La Sportiva Napole Cube GTX women's easily pulled ahead in our tests. Though it is the heaviest boot in the review, it has the highest climbing performance of any of the boots. It is a beefy, durable boot that is insulated and fully waterproof with a full leather upper and metal lace grommets. It has the most sophisticated lacing system of the boots we evaluated, allowing the wearer to customize tightness and fit, while providing excellent heel lock for steep ice climbing and front pointing. This boot performs for ice climbing, mixed climbing, and mountaineering. At number 2 though not ideal for vertical ice climbing, the La Sportiva Trango Cube GTX Women's is a top-notch three-season alpine boot that excels at hiking and rock climbing. It is incredibly lightweight and nimble, allowing the climber to move light and fast over snowy and rocky terrain. Footwear is arguably the best place to focus on going lightweight, just think of how many times you lift each foot en route to the summit, and suddenly shaving a few ounces becomes a much, much more significant savings. The Cube is a lightweight specialist, however, which comes at a cost to durability. That makes it a great sending boot for your fast and light missions, but it might not be your best choice for regular trips in rugged terrain. If you have a quiver of boots, however, this one will be beloved for its lightweight, tennis shoe-like feel, and your body will thank you at the end of a long day. At number 3 the Spantic from La Sportiva is an excellent high-altitude alpine climbing boot. It is very warm, especially for the weight. It is comfortable and supple. The boot has enough dexterity to feel precise on moderate alpine rock routes and to give you confidence on steep ice climbs. The double boot design adds warmth but also allows you to pull out the inner boot and keep it warm and dry in your tent or sleeping bag overnight. The Spantic is not waterproof, which is not ideal for some climbs or climates. We are glad to be able to pull the inner boot out and speed up the drying process, but when the sun is glaring on the glacier we trek across to get to higher elevations, this can be a troubling and soggy ordeal. The Spantics are also not optimized for rocky terrain or extended trail use, and while they perform very well, the durability will suffer from extended use on dry ground. The heel cup is a bit larger than the average female climber's heel, which meant that some of our female reviewers got a little heel lift when ice climbing and hiking. Overall, however, this is an excellent boot that offers a lot of good features for female alpinists. The features that were most pleasing to our female reviewers were the lightweight and suppleness of the outer boot. We know that it is best to think of pack weight as a percentage of body weight rather than a raw number, this means that smaller climbers will have to be stronger in order to carry a 50-pound pack because it might be nearly half of their body weight, but for a larger climber, this will be a lower percentage of body weight, which improves efficiency, assuming similarly fit climbers. The other, more anecdotal observation our reviews made was that the suppleness improved comfort and movement economy. We think this is because the boots are often scaled down in size but the materials used are the same, so for a smaller size, this may make the boot proportionally more rigid. The Spantic is well articulated and supple, and we noticed. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a nice day.